pent means we have five carbons in a row. The ene means there's a double bond starting at carbon one. That's what the one is for in front of pentene. Now we also have an ethyl group hanging off of carbon three. If this is carbon one, two, three, then this is the carbon we need to have the two carbon chain or ethyl group hanging off of. Then we have a methyl group hanging off of carbon number two. There we go, a one carbon chain hanging off of that. Now you're probably supposed to fill out the hydrogens. Each carbon needs four bonds total. And so if there aren't already four bonds to each carbon, it's going to be your job to add those carbons in. I didn't give, or sorry, hydrogens in. Oh, only two hydrogens there. This carbon needs three hydrogens. This carbon needs one extra. This carbon needs two extra. And this carbon needs three extra. This is your structural diagram for uh, three ethyl, two methyl, one pentene. Now you can also draw a skeleton diagram. That's one, two, three, four, five carbons in a row, a double bond for the pentene, a methyl group hanging off of carbon two, and an ethyl group hanging off of carbon three. This is also a valid structure. It doesn't show the hydrogens, but it does show the connectivity of the carbons. Thank you for being with me and best of luck.